Hello, my friends. We are back today with another Pokemon item to unbox. Today, I have the Blastoise GX Premium Collection box. We have the giant GX card. We've got the Squirtle Evolution here. I've been sitting on this for a little bit because I would not let myself open it until I edited the last video I posted. So, I just posted that today and here we are opening this sexy beast. Okay, let's get into this because I have been very excited to open this. I'm just kind of ripping it open because it's not of any value to me. And I will just throw it in the garbage. Here we go. This thing is huge, so I can barely even fit it into the frame, <laughs> but that's cool, that's fine. Here we've got the promo cards. Very nice. I hate how these are packaged because it's really hard to get them out of here without like bending them. Here we have the Squirtle Hollow. Oh, this is not a promo card. It's just um, part of the set, but still very, very awesome. I really like the bubbly hollow. They do that a lot and they do it really well. I had a black ring on last video and I lost it. God knows how. Here we have the war turtle hollow. Very, very cool looking. I really love the Squirtle Evolution. Uh, hot take, the Squirtle Evolution from Squirtle to Wartortle to Blastoise is the best evolution of the original three. I said it. Don't bludgeon me to death. Don't stone me. It's just my opinion but my opinion is right. Charizard can... I'm not even gonna say anything. I was gonna say something very inappropriate, but I'm not going to. Wow, look at that bad boy. Dude, that... That's awesome. I love the texture. The textured cards, always very cool. Full art. Promo for Blastoise GX. That is sick. And I'm going to put this in a hard case because I put, whoop, sorry, I was trying to look through the camera. <laughs> I tried to put all my promos in at least a sleeve, but for these really cool full art type promos, I like to put them in a hard case. We're gonna slide him in here. Real nice like. Perfect fit. And we're going to slide him into, oh geez. <laughs> what the hell? How did that get so dirty? Ew. We're using a different one. This one's better. Still kind of dirty though. It's pretty gross, but. <laughs> Oh well, we will slide him in here if I can. My hands are shaking. I have Parkinson's. Just kidding. Look how shiny and cool he is. Awesome. I'm also gonna sleeve these hollows because I sleeve any hollows that I get. It's just sort of something I do. Probably doesn't make a difference because I just put them in a binder, but having the extra protection on them, I feel like is probably a good idea. So there we have it. The awesome evolution chain, Squirtle, War Turtle, and Blastoise. Very nice. We've got a coin in here. Oh, I'm never gonna get this out. Blastoise coin already got a greasy fingerprint on it. 
How beautiful. This little box has six booster packs inside. Very, very cool. Not as much as the trainer box did in my last video, but this is not a trainer box, so I don't know why I would even compare it. <laughs> this card is huge. I can barely fit it into frame. It's just a bigger version of the other promo that I got. Last Voice GX. Honestly. The bigger, the better. This is sick, but I don't really have any use for these big cards because I don't have any way to store them or protect them. Um, my binder has like a little sheet on the front of it that I just kind of slide these in and I don't really care what happens to them. Oh, here we have the code card for the box. Mine, not yours. And we have this sick pin. I actually love pins. I use pins a lot. I put them on my bags, hats, jackets, whatever. And they add a cool little touch to really anything that you can put them on. Kind of personalize it to your own style. Yeah, I really like that pin. All right, that is it for the box. Now let's get into these bad boys. We've got six booster packs here, two Unbroken Bonds, one Lost Thunder, one Phase Collide, one Basic Sign Moon, and one Celestial Storm. I think we will save the two Unbroken Bonds for last, and we'll open the Sun and Moon one first, then we'll do, I'll just shuffle these three up. That was unnecessary. I really despise myself. Anyways, we'll just put these here and we will get into this sun and moon pack. Hopefully, we will, can we open this from the, yeah, okay. I'm not making the same mistake as last time and opening from the front so that I expose the color of the code card. I believe I just slide this off here not to spoil myself, yes and keep my little greedy code card for myself. Cause I'm a little troll, little greedy troll. Here we have a grass energy on the very front of the pack. A Puku Muku. Very weird name that I've always thought was very odd. <laughs> Any name with the word puke in it is probably something that I don't want to associate myself with. We've got a Switch. Nintendo Switch? No. Hypno, I really like that art. Very cool. Firo. Maka, Makuhita. Shelter. I can't talk. I'm, something's wrong with me. Shelter. Togedemaru. Poplio. Love this little dude. He is very, very cute. I love seals. He kind of looks like a seal. Adorable. We've got a Sharpedo Reverse Hollow. That is very cool. That is some sick artwork. I really like that. And on the very end, we have a Gigalith Hollow. Very cool. That's actually like a, a really awesome looking hollow. I like how you can like feel the impact when you look at it. Like <laughs> he just fucking jumped off a building and landed on the ground and the earth is just being destroyed at his feet. Very cool. And we'll grab a little sleeve here. Whoop. There we go. Gigalith Hollow for our first pack. Not bad. Let's gather up this bulk and put it to the side. I'm gonna bring these over here because my little arms can't reach that far. <laughs> now we are going to bust into the Fates Collide X and Y booster pack. Wow, that was, that was like butter to open. You know how bad I am at opening these? They need to make those like that again. Jesus 
Christ, that was smooth. Okay, I, I actually don't know about the, the card on the back this time. I'm going to take it off camera and take it off so I don't spoil it for the camera. Okay, yeah. so it is turned around and then I take it off so I don't spoil it for myself or for the viewers. Let's be honest, is anyone even gonna view this video? Who knows? But <laughs> in any case, I don't wanna spoil it. All right, so now we will take one, two, three, four to the front. This might be the rare. Damn it! Well, there you go. Zygarde as the rare. <laughs> XY packs, I suppose, don't have a, a uh, energy on them. That's annoying. Anyways, Helix Fossil Omanyte. I can read. Random Receiver. Audino Spirit Link. That's cool. That's a very different artwork, and that's a very cute Pokemon. Coughing. Vullaby. Vullaby? I don't know. Who cares? Ryolu. Cottony. A whole flock of cottony. The squad pulled the fuck up for this pick. Seal. And a Fennekin Reverse Hollow. I really like the fire reverse hollows. I think they look really good. And the colors of this really go together well. That's a nice reverse hollow. But the rare was kind of shitty. And that's okay. And now we got the Lost Thunder pack. This one will probably be... Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Something is going right for me today, I guess. Pull this off of here. Oh! I just spoiled it for myself. That's fine. Take the four. This is a Sun and Moon, so I think it's four. And yes, we have the Steel Energy on the front. Faba. What on earth? Look at this dude! <laughs> I don't even know what to say about this dude. The get up. He needs to fix that. <laughs> Sightseer. A queen. Delibird. Tangela. That background's really weird. Just like some yarn balls. Looks like it was made in MS Paint. Alolan Bull Pigs. Oh! <laughs> Jumping into the snow! That is precious. Look at her. Honestly, that's one of the cutest arts I've ever seen on a Pokemon card. Snubble. Marini. Cyndaquil. Bruxish Reverse Hollow. Ah! That is terrifying. And a Slow King Rare on the very end. Slow King's pretty cool, and that art is really really nice. Well, we're kind of getting shafted this video with the packs. We've got three left. We haven't gotten any really cool cards. We've got one hollow. Oh, that's good. Get rid of this trash. Throw this on the ground. Bad throw. Celestial Storm! Let's bust right into it! I can't stand myself sometimes. Do you ever just get really tired of yourself and like want to separate your soul from your body and just astral project into the void? No, just me? Okay. We've got the code card in the back for little old me and not you, Slugma. Got Larvitar, Wismer, Bellsprout, little gaggle of Bellsprouts, Whalmer, busting out of the sea. That's not the sea, that is a river. Clearly, I cannot see because I called that the sea. Got it. Oh shit, I didn't do the fucking four to the. 
Well, let's do it now. Period. Fighting energy. We've got the friend ball. Mawile with the creepy teeth, ears, Illumise, winking at the camera, Plusle. Very, very, very cute artwork. And on the very end, we have the Ultra Beast Cartana. Nothing amazing. I'm losing my patience. We've got two more packs and they are the Unbroken Bonds. This is my favorite set out of the packs that we got. So that's why I saved it for last. I'm gonna save the Machamp for last because I like Machamp. Although I do love Lucario as well. Let's get into it. These, I'm having a lot easier time opening these packs than I did in the last video. I don't know what was up with me. Okay, on this, I believe I just take it off like this. Yeah, okay. No spoilers in this house. Not in my Christian household. Okay, we've got, oh, I forgot. I cannot keep forgetting to do that because it's just stupid. Fairy energy on the very front. We've got a Metapod. He looks extremely depressed, like clinically depressed. He needs to reach out to someone. Firo, Graveler, that dude is round. Poliwag. I know I already saw this when I opened it, but that is the cutest little artwork. That is adorable. Look at him. I want to hug him. Ekans. Very weird looking. Drowsy. What the? He looks like that girl from the... 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 Commercial about not smoking weed or whatever, where she's all deflated on the couch. <laughs> he looks like that. What the hell? Pikachu. He's on a cruise ship or something. Good for him. Grubbin. Genesect versus Hollow. It's pretty cool looking. Nothing too great. And on the back. After Genesect, we have Zooey Mama! Oh my fucking god, look at that. Look! You're in. On the front of the. Yeah. Oh my god, look at that. Look at them! Holy shit, that is fucking awesome! Lucario and Mel Metal GX! Oh my god. I absolutely love the cards that have the blue outline. I think that looks sick. Dude, this is awesome. Steel Fist, Heavy Impact, Full Metal Wall with 260 HP. That is a sick card. That's fucking awesome. Hell yeah. Let me get a sleeve for this little bit. I knew. I, I knew that we would get something in Unbroken Bonds. I absolutely knew it. Unbroken Bonds is a fucking awesome set. And I feel like I just have good luck with Unbroken Bonds for some reason. This is awesome. It's not a secret rare. It's not a hyper rare or anything like that, but that is still an amazing pull. Yeah, I'm very, very happy with that. Put this bulk over here and we got the very last Unbroken Bonds, the very last pack of the video. If I get this card, I will, will actually shit my pants, I think. And here I go again. Being fucking stupid and not being able to open the pack. Alright. Now we have code card on the back. Don't know why I just said that like that. Four cards. Switch them from the back to the front. We've got a 
another fairy energy. Frogadier with some albino cocoa puffs hanging off of his body. Welder. This is a pretty good card. Um, it's very usable in game. Laron. Ghastly. Togepi. I fucking love Togepi. He is just cute. Like, bottom line. Point blank period. This is just a cute little dude. Another Pikachu on the cruise ship. Wow. I feel like I've been up here. Sorry about that. Murkrow. With his fancy little top hat head. Rhyhorn. Another one. Another Rhyhorn. As the reverse. Hollow. This artwork is much, much better in my opinion. That's very cool looking. I like the colors. And on the very end, the very last card of the video, we have... <laughs> Slazzle. That was very disappointing. I wish I would have saved the other pack for the last pack. So we could have had a nice ending. Went out with a bang. But we got two cool cards. One very cool card. Lucario and Melmetal. Very, very, I just burped. Very, very cool, cool, very swag, I like it. And the Gigalith Hollow, which is also pretty awesome. And not a bad pull, but this is the star of the video. Just, just stare at him for a minute. Just revel in his beauty. Oh, <clears throat> almost dropped him. That is a good pull. And that honestly made the whole box worth it, in my opinion. All right, well, that'll be it for this video. If you're still watching, thank you very, very much. I appreciate you. And I hope you enjoyed your time here with me. If you did, leave me a like, perhaps. Mayhaps leave me a comment if you're feeling brave. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.